coffee. Coffee now! <laughs> It's a streaking light that had a lot of people looking up and wondering throughout Southern California. Tonight, we have the first images. Plus, we have insight into what was that fireball in the sky. NBC 4's Robert Kavasik is live for us up at Griffith Park. Robert? Chuck and Colleen, if this was actually a fireball, it was certainly far-reaching. We first heard about it from you, our viewers, around 8 o'clock tonight from all over Southern California, thanks in part to the clear skies that we have this evening. Now, fortunately, there were no reports of any injuries. No one had to duck, but no joke here, Chuck and Colleen. This comes on the very same day that NASA scientists say a meteor hitting our planet is four or five times more likely than they ever anticipated. It arrived in the atmosphere in a flash and elicited fascination across the American West. On the AMS Fireball website, Space may be the final frontier, but take a look at this YouTube video from South L.A. and you'll understand it's the first thing everybody's talking about tonight. Dave Morgan spotted it in San Dimas. It was so large and so the trail was so big and it, the explosion, it was pretty amazing. A fireball or bright meteor lit up the sky and then social media. So what is happening? It's probably just a rogue meteor, just like the one over Russia earlier this year. You know, no one saw it coming and... Wow, that made their day. It was quite bright. It arrived in the atmosphere in a flash and elicited fascination across the American West. On the AMS Fireball website, Alexander from St. George, Utah writes, awesome. And observer John B. in Temecula says it's the most brilliant white object I've ever seen. Looks as bright as burning phosphorus. Fortunately, meteors mostly stay in the sky. But remember what happened in Russia in February. That meteor meant injured some 1,600 people. Today, NASA revealed the threat of smashing space rocks is bigger than they first thought. Instead of 3 million zipping around the solar system, NASA now says there are 20 million up in the sky, and that's where they're hoping they stay. It was bright, it was huge, it had a large trail, and I just went, whoa, and then the, it looked like it fell be came behind the trees, it sort of exploded. Now, if you missed it, not to be too disappointed, the torrid meteor shower is currently in our atmosphere, and our Fritz Coleman is going to have more on that coming up for you in just a few minutes. For now, we are live here in the Hollywood Hills with our eyes to the sky. I'm Robert Kavasik. Let's go back to you.